Hi everyone, it's Phil here from Ashland Leather and I wanted to give you a quick little update on how this natural latigo has been wearing. I've been wearing this for exactly two weeks. In fact, I have a uh, little note here that says my my first wearing was on May 27th. And I think what you're seeing here is a lot of the color crocking coming off of my denim and rubbing onto this light color of latigo. I'm really surprised at how quickly this is accumulating. All the denim staining, especially in the corners and where the you can really see where the dollar bills sit in the bill slot here. The other really interesting thing to, that I've observed on the natural latigo is how the luster has changed. It's become a lot brighter and shinier and you might be able to see how it highlights where the cards sit in these card slots. And the color has not darkened up too much just yet. I do expect this leather to get a little bit darker, but it's to me, it's really interesting wearing these with the raw denim. It sort of shadows out a lot of the wallet with that denim color. So here's a good look at how the wallet looked new. You can see the new wallet on the left here is a little bit more like a matte finish. And as I've worn it, it's become a bit shinier and bright, which is really neat. And then obviously the other thing about it is all that denim staining on this particular one. The color doesn't seem to have changed much more than the denim. So this is the last call to pick up one of these natural Latigo Fat Herbies. You can wear it along with me. We've got a little bit of a pre-order sale going on for these right now. And you can combine our Father's Day discount with this one. And on the table here, you see I've got eight new leathers on the lighter sheath. So these are Bic lighters with different leather sheaths. And I just put up each of these on the flash sale page of our website. Brown football leather here. I don't think we've ever done this one before. It's got pretty nice reddish undertones, a little bit more like a burgundy undertone with a darker brown surface. We also have our most popular leather. This is the English tan Dublin. Here's another one. We did a, a couple of these in the black printed gator shell cordovan. Here's one in the most red shell cordovan color, the garnet shell cordovan, and this is pretty neat. Some angles it's a little bit more red and other angles it almost looks more like the color eight shell, like right there, and a little bit more red at this angle. And here's another leather that I like very much. This is something that is new to me. We made a couple Johnny the Foxes last week that sold out kind of quickly, but this is a leather called Pearl DeVille, and it's a really nice gray shade. It's hard to find gray leathers, which is why I think this one is so cool. Here's a great leather for patina. If you want something that's going to change very dramatically, this is the raw natural shell cordovan and the patina that accumulates on this is about as good as it gets. And the leather itself will get much darker, a little bit more golden brown color. Here's another fun one that we only have a couple of. This is the Western texture on the garnet shell cordovan. And last but not least, another Western texture, but this is on the denim blue shell cordovan. And I'm really happy with all these lighter sheaths in particular, the gray one here this Pearl DeVille leather, I think is really cool. And I like doing these lighter sheets for a little bit of a lower price point, just to get more leather into people's hands. All right, here is a bottle opener with an English tan Dublin leather sheath. And we're putting this up for Father's Day because I figure that dad needs a beer. So this is made with an English tan Dublin handle and a stainless steel piece of metal. The other item that I'm putting up on the website today, this is just like our normal English tan Dublin giant the fox but i felt a little bit strange about this one because this particular shade of dublin is a little bit darker and more brown than our normal english tan dublin and i just didn't want to be misleading so we're putting this up as dark english tan dublin the leather on the interior is a little bit lighter and a little bit more orange like our normal dublin wallets so you can find this one on the giant the fox page so thanks for checking out all the lighters and lighter sheets and bottle openers and new giant the fox and this natural latigo fat herbie and i'm really happy with how this one is accumulating all that denim staining from my jeans. I think this is pretty special. And again, today's the last day to pick up one of these if you're into it. We did a little reminder on our Instagram yesterday evening and a bunch of people picked it up since then. So I figured I'm not doing a very good job telling people that this is now available. And today's the last day. We'll be doing another special pre-order with a new leather tomorrow on the Fat Herbie. So thanks for checking it out. Hope you have a good one and take care.